Hello, so today I am going to show you how to make your own DIY stickers. I can go get them in a moment. I just have a few here. You can hand draw your stickers or you can print something out. I am going to show you how to make the printed ones because probably you know how to draw something. Like drawing is something that everyone could do. Everyone has a talent for anything. Maybe someone can't draw that well as me or something. Uh, but these are my handmade ones, handmade stickers. Uh, here I hand drew this one and a little pizza. Sort of like a pushing pizza. Pushing the cat is really cute. Um, so I am going to show you now how to make these. So let's get into it. So I have printed out this here. And this. And I'm going to cut out the ones that I want, leaving a little border around, but you don't have to leave a border. So I'm going to now cut it out. So once you have it all cut out, you will be left with something like this. I have only cut out one to show you uh, one of these that I make. Now you will need some parchment paper some scissors and some tape. I am going to get the things and we'll do it. Forgot to mention that you can also use wax paper but I'm using parchment paper. Um, so next thing you want to do is take your tape and cut off a piece. Make sure it will be able to stick the whole thing and leave a little border and stick it onto your parchment paper. I will be using like three pieces. Um, packing tape will also work. Actually packing tape is, a, is even better because I'm using scotch tape and it's much thinner kind of. Uh, and packing tape, I would be already done. <laughs> so, this is what you'll be left with. I don't know if you can see. Oh, here's the tape because it's shiny a bit more. Now, you'll place your sticker on top so there is still a little bit of space around it. And you'll cover it in tape again. So, I'm going to come back when the tape is all put on. Again, you will have to leave a little border around it, it's a, a little bit of space, so it's enough to cut out a border. So next thing you will do is cut it out, of course, um, leaving a border around the border. <laughs> okay, this is strange, um, but leaving a little bit of space around here. I don't know if you can see it, but I have left a little bit of space around. You'll see it once I am done cutting. So now it is done. And here you have it. Here is a little bit of border. And the backing paper is the parchment paper or your wax paper. And it sticks perfectly well. It sticks as much as tape and uh, you can stick it onto furniture. Like, for example, I can show you what I made. Um, I have here put on um, one of my, wait, here a Pusheen sticker. Uh, wait, a Pusheen the cat sticker. How can I show you like this? Can you, oh, here, this little kitty here. Uh, this is what I have. And so this is everything that I wanted to show you for this video. It was really short, um, but this is what you have in the end. 
I might be able to show you this better version, but I think not. I'll leave a link in the description down below for these two little sticker sheets. Here, I cut it already out. <laughs> That's this ice cream cone. Um, so, goodbye! You are not going to do what I am doing, you're going to find the link in the description because I just, I don't know why, I just showed this. So you can watch I'm doing this. I think it's already done. I don't know. <laughs> so goodbye.